But uh, in the meantime, we're going to talk uh, about the world of private aviation. Wheels Up founder Kenny Dichter is here. He's joined by Scott Ernst. He's the CEO of Textron Aviation to discuss their latest partnership and talk business conditions in the sky. We're back with them in just a moment. Let's fly, let's fly away. We'll be on it before you. Wheels Up is reaching new heights. The private aviation powerhouse is introducing 10 custom Cessna Citation aircraft to its fleet. Joining us now to talk about the deal, Kenny Dichter, founder and CEO of Wheels Up, and Scott Ernest, president and CEO of Textron Aviation. Cessna is a subsidiary uh, of Textron Aviation. And Kenny, you started uh, Marquee Jet, and, and I want to be someday... I wish I could be a marquee jet card holder, but it's just too much money. Well, no, but now he wants to be a wheels. You got to bring it down, and that's what you're Joe, trying to do. Joe, we, we created wheels up for guys like you and Andrew well, and Bob. Someday, yeah. No, but, someday. Okay, next someday. contract. But the beauty of this, and Scott, thanks for joining. You were <laughs> the, the Cessna. I have been on a uh, at some point a Cessna Citation. The, the, jets the, are, the ten is your favorite plane the, in the world. Unbelievable! They, they fly high, they fly fast. You know, Gulf streams are beautiful. I understand that, but but the, the Citation is beautiful. So you got the Cessna, right? And then you bought in. Uh, you got Beachcraft. the King Airs uh, right. for Textron, and and these are the exact planes that he needs for wheels up. This was like a marriage that you guys are like. Uh, is it just business? Or are you, you know, it's, it's, you're together all the time, are you? Like best friends. <laughs> no, it, it's, uh, listen, uh, it's Scott. It's business. It is, <laughs> no, I don't, I don't mean that. But, but <laughs> wheel, not that there's anything wrong with it. But Wheels Up, uh, I mean, you are a huge, how, how much business is we, are you getting from Wheels Up for, for a text run aviation at this point? Well, right now, Kenny's got uh, 10 XLs that he's order. purchased. And he's got three of them delivered. We've got another one that will come this month. And, and how many, uh, for people that don't know, the King Air is a prop plane. Yep, right. Turboprop. 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 Turboprop, where if you're going, if you're a business person and you're going city to city within a state or, or adjoining states, it, for, for a, an hour on Marquee, what is it, like 10 grand or no, something? It's, it's probably, the entry level is probably around $8,000. 8000 You can do this for, fit, for half of it. thirty nine fifty per hour. And the, uh, the great thing about what Textron's done to support us and their, their purchase of Beechcraft is we've taken 20, well, we will take 27 King Airs right. between October and and 15 months by the end of this year. We're actually almost 20 airplanes in. As Scott said, we're going to have four XLs, three are delivered, uh, by June 30th. So uh, on top of that, obviously, you met Thomas you Fleur. Further, we have the, and, the and Global got, 5000 with Thomas and Vista. Which is an incredible uh, top shelf, top, top of the line uh, business yeah, jet. Sure, and that'll take anywhere They're in the world. In Japan. Yeah. So what, what we have here is we have 42 airplanes that we'll have by year end. Uh, as I promised uh, our investors and you guys, we right. are approaching the 500 member mark, which will happen by June 30th, and we'll have 1,200 members by year end. If we're averaging 20 hours a member, you're talking about 24,000 hours a lift. We're lucky to have Textron uh, behind yeah. us and yeah. uh, supporting us here. How many members do you need to make this, this work? Because you've, you've, this is a huge investment. In terms of the, in terms sure. of the, the well, aircraft, I, I would tell you right here, Andrew. I feel look, the first 500, the first 1,200, those are the tough ones. Yeah. Um, at Marquee, we uh, got 10,000 unique people to buy Marquee cards. I will tell you right here on the show that five years from now, we will have more people flying privately through Wheels Up than any company in the world. Kenny, you've done a marvelous job. We were on together when you first started this. Yeah. Uh, I was sitting next to you, and you've done a great job. And Scott, and certainly Scott Donnelly. Yeah, it was a, it was a brilliant a acquisition. Text a text text oh, yeah. Scott Donnelly, a good friend, and I've always been a big admirer of him. And what both of you have done over there is amazing in working with Kenny on this. Yeah, well, fantastic. I'd say the, the whole integration has, has come together extremely well. I mean, the two facilities were within eight miles of each right. other, and the product mix uh, was, was an excellent fit. I mean, I was going to say, you know, there's you look at uh, in, in tough economic times, the dollar stores and the Walmarts do a little bit better. Um, it's never going to be like this, where wheels up is for people that can't do market. There's, there's never going to be, it, there are always going to be one percenters. But it's almost at a point now where, let's say some guys from New York are going to Hilton Head mm -hmm. or Sea Island. And how many guys can go on the King Air? That, that's a perfect trip. That's eight guys. Eight, eight guys. Eight guys, eight golf bags, 8,000. Okay, so do, yeah, do the eight economics. Guys, eight, eight, eight guys, eight golf bags, 8,000. Thousand dollars a piece. Thousand bucks a piece each way. Each way. Two thousand for the round. Two thousand for the round, uh, I, I, and, which is if it's if you're going first class, it's more than that on, on Delta. Or even if you're if you buy late, it's probably seven or eight hundred dollars for uh, you know each way to go down. I mean, it's getting right. to the point where you don't need to be 
I remember in, in the original Wall Street, it was like, buddy, you know, you're not some, you, you yeah. have enough money to buy debt, not some guy who makes 400000 a year and flies first hey, this class. Guy, this guy's repping for you. That's <laughs> a hell of a deal. Listen, Joe, Joe Kerr, we, we, we put the program together for guys like Joe. But I can't afford it yet. Now, you, I love that you say you fly Delta and you don't fly around on jets. That's because you, you don't want someone taking down your tail number and saying Nardelli's on a private jet. Well, That's why. I, I remember vividly uh, at a congressional hearing, you know, getting uh, ambushed by, right. by, by that. So you still are, are scarred from that? Still scarred. I love well, when you, but I love when you tell me you can't afford to buy a wheel. No, I'm, I'm, I'm aspiring. In first class. I, I, at some point, I'm going to be able to handle this 39.95. We can't. Yeah. 39. 50, 50. 50. I, I would tell you one thing that's amazing, and I, I've gotten to know Scott and Scott really well, is the the uptick that they're seeing in the whole aircraft business and what's happening out there on the street. I mean, to me, it's a leading indicator of what's happening in the economy. And uh, Scott, yeah, I, I would say, you know. The, the oil and gas was always strong, but you start. We, we look at all the different verticals, and we're starting to see real estates coming back, constructions coming back, um, the the medical field. So those type of individuals are back in the market, and they've their you know their businesses are starting to fill. In, instead of even talking about us, uh, talk about. I mean, there are small businesses where. I know that private jets with CEOs has a bad image, but there are times where a guy doesn't really want to be in a commercial airport. And if you need, if you've got a, a regional business that is uh, like in the Midwest, let's say you do Illinois, Ohio, Indiana, and Missouri right. or something, and you need to visit a lot of places, I mean, this is perfect for that. You do it, you, you do it and, and you don't need to own the jet. Uh, as the company, because a lot of these small companies aren't going to be yeah. jet owners. Right? And they can hit three or four locations in one day. And that's not yeah. opulence. That's not throwing your money around because you've got it. That's actually probably more cost effective for shareholders and business owners than. Yeah. than what's the program? Though? Do you have to put money up front? It, and, and is that 39.50? It's, it's, is it's, that all in? 39.50 is all in. Uh, you have FET on top of that, which is for everybody, federal yeah. excise tax. But to join the program, Bob, unlike a marquee or, or one of the other card programs or fractional programs, the downstroke is very reasonable. It's $15,750 to join the club. Yep. You have annual dues of $7,250. That allows us to own the aircraft as, a, as wheels up and allow the members to, to fly when they need it. Is that a one-time, the 72 one-time, or is that an one time, annual? One-time, one 15750 right, yeah. 72 50 annual. Stuff. And the I mean, 15, really I'm going to get a, right when we go to commercial break, I'm grabbing Bob's credit card. Is the 15 <laughs> use it or lose it on an annual basis? Uh, the 15 is just the, the downstroke to get into the club to uh, yeah. be able to book. Now, so I got you. How much, we take American how much Express, on Visa, on money for? orders. Are you financing these for him? How much is he like, is his life in, I mean, how much is he on the hook for with Texas? No. I mean, they're, they're actively uh, securing finance. Yeah, I, was, I would tell you, it's not from Textron. I will oh. tell you right here that uh, Richard Handler and his company over at Jefferies has been absolutely unbelievable in the so credit So they're helping finances. So. They're engineering. They engineered us a PowerPoint, an idea, with an order from yep. uh, Beechcraft, $1.4 billion. To make this work. They, they got the financing done. You know we did the equity. We knocked on doors. Right. And uh, we have 350 equity and investors. Equity. We need, we need um, the economy to, we don't need another financial crisis. I mean, don't you wake, you wake up at 3 a.m. scared yeah. to, no, no, not, listen, I would say a year ago, go, a, year ago a year ago, we had a PowerPoint. Okay, that's scary. Yeah. Now we have 27 King Airs. 10 XLSs and five. So it's on the way. It's not on the makes way. Makes me nervous. The, the first 500. Uh, don't don't be nervous, Joe. 500 okay. members are ready. 500 end of the year. We'll have 10,000 by 2000. You okay? With that? I'm. I'm. There's no kids on the plane, so I'm okay. Oh, that's right. You don't. There's I'm no babies on the. I, I forgot about that. That's why he needs to fly private. He Kenny, hates Kenny screaming Dicker, brats on the plane. Thank you. It's great to see all of you guys. Congratulations, everybody. The Fed in focus.